Maka's guides. <laughs> Hey everyone, Maka here playing Elden Ring and I come bearing some bad news. Do not hug the lady in the hold unless you have a good reason to. Let me explain. Now in the top left corner next to your health, focus power, and stamina, you'll notice that some squares pop up occasionally. These are known as status effects or buffs and debuffs. And currently you'll see that I have a red and a green one. This is due to the fact that I have two talismans equipped for both health and stamina. And if I take those off, you'll notice that these status effects are gone. Now, when you hug the lady at the hold, this causes a negative status effect, also known as a debuff, where you lose 5% of your overall health. Let me show you that in action right now. You can see, as soon as I'm done getting the affectionate hug, I will be given an item called Baldashin's Blessing. This is very important, but I will also have that debuff in the top left corner, which takes away 5% of my overall HP. So you may be asking yourself, why would anyone take this penalty to their health voluntarily? And there is actually a good reason. It has to do with the Baldashin's Blessing item that you do get. You can basically use Baldishan's Blessing to trade FP into a temporary boost in poise, lasting 15 seconds. After the 15 seconds, the debuff to your HP will also be cleansed. Your poise stat will determine what type of enemy attacks you're able to block without collapsing. The higher the stat, the more enemy attacks you'll be able to block. This will help you if you are trying to defeat a boss that is well above your level range or your armor range. You may actually find a couple of scenarios in the game where this blessing will help you absorb hits from a boss that you normally wouldn't be able to, which is why I would only recommend using this in a boss battle in the first place. The worst thing you can do is go to the hold, receive the hug, get Baldishan's blessing, and then just keep playing the game without using it. This is basically giving yourself a penalty full time. Also, something to note is that when you do use the blessing, it will cleanse the debuff and you will see the difference in your health bar, but it won't automatically refill unless you use a flask or visit a site of grace. I just wanted to give everyone that quick warning that you can hug Fia if you want to. There are some advantages to doing so, but doing so just to carry the blessing consumable ends up biting you in the butt in the long run and I would highly advise against it. Make sure you share this video with a friend so they know what they're doing too. Thank you so much for watching. I hope it was helpful. Drop a like. Special thanks everyone on Patreon for supporting the show and hopefully I see you soon. Peace.